I have today William Veblet, and he has a company called Flowing Edge, and it is a disruptor type of company. It's going in there into an industry of how you move files around and transfer files. He's got an unlimited service working in a way that is simpler, faster, and far more secure. Uh, William, I want to introduce you now to the audience. They want to know just how this works for business to business. And possibly uh, a little bit more uh, detail. I may have a few questions for you. Go ahead, Will. Introduce yourself. Thanks, you. Michael. I appreciate it. Yes, so my name is William Vambley. Uh I have been working on this product for about two years now. Uh, we decided that we were going to take the challenge of uh, a, a piece of technology that's been kicked down the road for the last 20 years. There's not been any innovation in this space that long. And we decided that it's about high time that so there's got to be a better way of sending files from one device to another. And so if I asked you how you go about sending a file today, you would probably say to me, oh, I have to upload a file and then it goes to a server and then an email comes out of that server to the recipient and that recipient has to wait for that email to arrive and then they follow the link back to the server where you send it and then they can download the file. And that's the whole process. All the different services out there happen to be on the same working process that I just outlined. The issue is that the minute you hand over a product, a file, you're handing it off to a third party. So you're basically giving it, you're giving your files to some other system, a cloud, and you don't know where that went. You don't know who it went to. And then it's a sitting duck for anybody to help themselves to the file. Even though what you really wanted to do was just get a quick delivery of the file that you're sending to the person you're sending it. So we said, what, there's got to be a better way of sending stuff. Why are we still using email? Why are we still using cloud services? Let's remove the cloud completely. And so what we did, we eliminated the cloud. So now this is the first time this technology has been out there. You can now send a file from any device. That means that we created applications that run on a mobile device, an iOS or Android or desktops, Mac, PC or Linux. And you can send any size file. There's no limits because we're not storing it anywhere. It's going straight to a someone, somebody else anywhere in the world, wherever you like, for as long as you like. And so that's the basis of Flowing Edge. And after two years, we figure out that we've got a product that's for businesses, the a real alternative now to delivery of files, because not only do we allow to de deliver those files, but we're encrypting it end to end. So it's super secure. It's using military grade encryption. And on top of that, it's super fast because we're not using the usual way of sending files. And on top of that, it's not going to ever receive spam or email for any system. We built it so that it's robust and allows, if any time there's a disconnect between the two devices, we've built in something called Smart Resume, and it will continue to deliver the file from where it left off when the connection was interrupted, and will continue to, to deliver it right until the very end. You get a notification. And now you are able to send gigabytes of data from a phone to a, a desktop on the other side of the world, completely transparently. Does that answer your question? That's fantastic. Yes, that's fantastic. So I can see business to business really grabbing onto this, especially you mentioned it being unlimited. That's fantastic. What about consumers? What kind of consumer product do you have? Do you have something there that'll work for them as well? Yes. About the beginning of the year, we decided to make things even easier. And we said that B2B requires a subscription, a reject registration of the user. With a B2C, you can literally go to the App Store or Play Store, download the app. There's no registration required. And the mobile app acts as a key to unlocking all the free apps that are already installed. You can install them on any desktop you like. You can have a, a, a farm of PCs and Macs in your home. And uh, <laughs> at the same time, 
you bring in one mobile device that you've paid for, and they all auto detect each other. And now you can send files between PC, Mac, Linux, Android, and iOS. And it's you easy to just use. made it. I'm sorry. I'm just so excited. You definitely made it so much easier to solve the huge problem that consumers have just moving files from one device to another. Uh, personally, I've got two towers and four laptops. Yes, I have a home business, but sometimes I've got files on, on other machines. And either I have to network it and take that risk of what can happen there, or maybe I can't remember the darn Windows password to even collect the two. It's just crazy. But if I could, it can use this just to send large files, especially when you're doing video, how much time it takes to upload and then download and wait for an email and all of that. It's a waste of time. You are really putting time back into people's hands. That's fantastic, William. We have already a plugin. They call it an add-in at Microsoft, which is free. The add-in is allowed, you, you can add that to any Outlook or Office 365 application. Fantastic. You don't need to change the, the use of Outlook. You don't need to reconfigure Outlook. You don't have to touch it. All it does is it creates a little drop zone in the side of your e editing file for email and you drop the file in if it's three gigabytes it doesn't matter you just drop it in and automatically flowing edge wakes up encrypts the file generates what's called a web link that we call a web link and that is inserted into your email as a text is it's basically a super url you carry on email, you're writing your email, you press the send key, it runs exactly the same as any email, delivers it to the recipient. On their end, they have Flowing Edge running on their system. They have to have Flowing Edge running on their system. The minute they press the link on email, it wakes up Flowing Edge and the delivery begins between you and your recipient directly without going through the email system. No store and forward, no emails, no cloud all secure directly to your recipient. So we've got that already working. We were certified by Microsoft. It's on a private link because their policy is to only have plugins that work within their own environment without an extra app associated with it. But they said it's such a great product that they would put it up there and there's a link already available and we can share that with uh, your listeners and your viewers, if they would be liking to uh, try it out. Yes, I see that Microsoft has gotten much more competitive. They've upped their quality of some of their software. I started using ClipChamp. I know that doesn't have to do with trail transfer, but it does have to do with videos and moving videos around. And now that's part of the Microsoft 365 family. And for you to be accepted and to be in, that's huge. And that, that just shows there's a lot of trust already proven in what you're doing and how you're doing it. That's something any business or consumer can just grab onto. Instead of storing it, you're actually just storing it on the person who's receiving it. That's you it. You don't so, have any cost that's necessary. So tell me about how you, how your strategy is there, how you're going to help people there. We priced it to, to be a disruptor. And so we started off with basically the, the flowing edge for business because we've been at it so long. But our disruptive right. price, at an introductory price of $36 a year, $3 per user per month. That's 36 bucks a year for all the size files that you want, sent to as many people as you want all day long. It doesn't matter. It doesn't affect us because we don't store it. We're not a storage company, right? We're a delivery company. There's a difference. The difference is most people today are working as a in a, with a Pony Express type mail delivery system or file delivery right. system. We've just come out with FedEx, a set, a quick, the FedEx, right? So we've gone from Pony Express to FedEx, where you can watch the real-time delivery from your device to the recipient using a real-time progress bar right to the very recipient that it needs to get to. So... That's huge in terms of the ability to allow them to give the flexibility and to take back control of their data, because now everyone has the ability to take control back of their data and not have to hand it over to a third party. The Flowing Edge uh, Home Edition, we've priced it at $10 per year as an introductory price. Oh, gosh. So yeah, literally good. that allows you to do everything within a Wi-Fi environment. Your Home Edition is literally operates like AirDrop 
on steroids because now the walled garden's gone. You can use all the different devices you have, but you can send it all over your Wi-Fi and keep things completely secure. This is ideal for homes. If you have family visiting 4th of July, Christmas, and they're all taking videos and they, and at the end of the day, they want to share it with Auntie Mabel and they can't get it to that device because they have to plug something physically into their phone or something like that. Now they can do that easily without any issues at all. So that's amazing. That's, that's amazing. Question. If you really understand what it is to just get away from all that storage fees, some people paying 100 a year, 200 a year for terabytes or gigabytes of space. And now they actually don't need it. You actually don't need to be paying that money out. No, because and you've got a better, a better service. Yeah. We're normally conditioned to thinking that the only way to send a file is the way that everyone sends a file. Upload, stick it on somebody else's machine, and then download from it, right? There, now mm -hmm. you've got real op option that actually works directly. And what, we've, what we're seeing also is because we don't mess with the file, with the data, we don't compress the data at all. We don't do special little tricks and do double back somersaults just to make it go faster. It really goes faster. We get 70 times speed through the, through the normal channels. And we also do not mess with the data. So for example, industries like uh, healthcare that have to send patient records or data like x-rays and things right. like that, it's not a good sign if you compress a file, an x-ray, and at the other end, the doctor's opening it up and there's big holes in it where you've actually taken bits out to compress it, right? So we don't do anything like that. We don't mess with the file. It just gets there as quickly as possible. And we know, for example, that you don't have to ever do upload or download anymore. So you're already twice as fast, even just not using upload and download techniques. And then you have a progress bar, which is the first in the industry, which actually shows you the progress from your device to the one that you're delivering to. No one ever does that. The only progress bars or little circles that go round and round in circles when you're uploading to their device, not to the recipient. Right. We're about delivery. We're about getting it, getting all those de bits to, to as quickly as possible to the other end. And we've been sending gigabytes of data to phones in Nigeria and Africa. We have the largest bank in Africa using it. We have several companies using it over there in oil and gas. So we're very happy with, with where it's going, actually, because they don't have the alternatives or the flexibility that we do to provide that service. Wow. More Americans are going to want to jump on this in a heartbeat. Everyone's watching their, we hope uh, their <laughs> money these days. and Anything that can cut costs is, is a godsend. It's really important these days. But just I just think about the security. It, there's another way of looking at it. It's, I'm not sending, I, I'm able to send you the groceries right from my house, basically. I don't have to put it into a distribution center. There is no distribution center. It's going from my house to your house directly, and it's there in seconds. Uh, that's just crazy good. I am so glad to uh, run into you, uh, meet you the first time the other day, and to get a chance to take a deep dive on this. The, the website, again, is uh, uh, dot .com. com. And when you get on the, the home screen, really simple. There's just two buttons there. Hit the home one if you're looking at the home business type, uh, home service, you, you, you feel it's consumer use, go with that. The business is so good of a price, yeah. you know, that's probably the better deal because you're just able to receive and send and do everything. and. It's built for, it's built to make your business shine. That's what it's built for. So you never want your business to fall behind. So that's why you need flowing edge. I There's a lot to take in. Uh, I don't want to yes. uh, get people too confused, but if they have any questions nope. for them to give me a shout at William at flowing edge.com, I'll be happy to answer any questions uh, to any of your re uh, viewers. Fantastic. I want to thank you for the time, Will. Oh, let me ask a question. I'm going to throw a curveball at you. What is it that you do outside of work that brings joy or calmness? The time you get to really relax, is it all family or are you out there doing something? You love to go fish or swim or whatever it is. I actually draw and paint and oh, uh, wow. enjoy getting lost in a canvas or a piece of paper and doodling and, and drawing whatever I, whatever comes up. And 
I've always been like that, actually. I was actually a graphic design artist before I went into engineering at college. It was, it's always been a passion of mine. And I continue to do, do that because it, it, I just, I'm very calm when, when I'm doing the, the artistic side of me. So that's really what I do. You get into the zone. It's, it's a beautiful thing when you can feel that joy. And of course, you turn out a, a piece and others see it and their reaction to it too is, is a, a fun thing to see and enjoy. Great. So that's what you do with your free time. Okay. That's a pretty good one. I'll bet we have a few artists out there that uh, love to do the same thing. Thank you, so thank you so much. You thank have a you, super sir. day and hope to see you again. Thanks. All right. Thank you, Michael. Bye.